Hello I hope you are all doing okay. Today, we are going to take a close look at simple machines. Today we will look at types, definitions, and examples of simple machines. Let us define what a simple machine is. A simple machine is a mechanical device with few or no moving parts that makes work easier when a force is applied. Let us now look at the types of simple machines. I am sure you have used some of these already or at least seen some of them around your house or community. Simple machines include lever, inclined plane, screw, wedge, wheel and axle, and pulley. A fact about simple machines that you need to remember is that simple machines may increase or reduce the applied force, but they do not change the total amount of work needed to perform the overall task. Let's now define each type of simple machine and look at some examples, starting with levers. Do you know that levers are very common machines around our houses? A lever is a bar that is used to lift or move objects by rotating at a fulcrum. Some examples of levers include seesaw, wheelbarrow, chopsticks, and scissors. Don't you think Snoopy is too far from the pivot? Poor birdies. Let's now slide into the definition for inclined planes. Do you know that inclined planes can be fun? Yes, because they are used to make slides and skateboard ramps. An inclined plane is a flat surface with one end higher than the other. Inclines are used to move object easily from a low point to a high point. Some examples of inclined planes include wheelchair ramps, loading ramps for trucks, playground slides and inspection ramps in mechanic shops. I know you can't wait for summer to enjoy the water slides. I am definitely looking forward. Let's look at screws. I know all of you know what screws look like, but do you know what they really are as a simple machine? Well, a screw is an inclined plane wrapped around a cylinder. Screws are used to hold things together. Look at the pictures carefully to see the inclined planes. Look closely to see the inclined plane moving along the metal cylinder. Like screws, wedges are closely related to inclined planes. A wedge is an inclined-shaped object that is thick at one end and thin at the other end. A wedge is used to separate objects by cutting, splitting, or piercing. Some examples of wedges include axe, nails, shovel, and knives. You really must be careful when using this group of simple machines. You can see the wood splitting and going in different directions. Now it's time to turn to wheel and axle. This group of simple machines really keep us moving. A wheel and axle is a circular disc called a wheel attached to a central rod called the axle that allows movement. Both the wheel and axle turn at the same time. Some examples of wheel and axle include bicycles, toy cars, merry-go-round, and even chariots. Look at those wheels go. Now it's time for our last group of simple machines. Pulleys are very useful. A pulleys are defined as one or more grooved wheels connected by rope, belt, or chain. Pulleys are used to lift or lower objects along a height. Some examples of pulleys can be seen on cranes, water wells, flagpoles, and on construction sites. That's a pulley system at work, so powerful. Thank you for watching, I really want to tell you that I appreciate you being here. Please like, comment, share and don't forget to subscribe. Most importantly, remember that the simple things in life matter.